Show yourself. Looking for a scary movie to watch on Netflix? Any time is the right time to watch a horror movie. As one of the most prolific and profitable subgenres in cinema, audiences are always in the mood for some spooky scaries. Fortunately, thanks to the accessibility of streaming services, places like Netflix are home to a plethora of chilling choices. To get you started, we've tracked down some of the must-see horror titles currently available to stream on Netflix. Watch the full video. But before we start, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and ring the notification bell to stay updated with more exciting content. Number 1. Tin and Tina Tin and Tina is a psychological thriller from Spain about a recently married couple, Adolfo and Lola, who suffer the loss of a child when Lola has a miscarriage. Determined to raise children together, they turn to a convent that has an abundance of orphans to care for, and they end up going home with a pair of odd twins, the titular Tin and Tina. The film has many horror aspects intertwined with religious imagery that perfectly reflect the crisis of faith that Lola is fighting her way through, as she tries to temper her grief by being overly accommodating to these children who may have been sent from hell itself. Number 2. Deliver Us From Evil Deliver Us From Evil follows New York police officer Ralph Sarchi as he teams up with local priest Mendoza to battle the strange demonic possessions that seem to be taking over their city. Exorcism is the order of the day, with the film likened to the likes of The Right and The Conjuring, with Scott Derrickson's fantastic direction pulling the audience into all sorts of uncomfortable terror. Supposedly based on a true story, Deliver Us From Evil doesn't just erratically bring bone-chilling scares, it does so with intellect, with the film itself benefiting from having much more to say than its otherworldly demonic narrative may suggest. Mommy. Number 3. The Pope's Exorcist The Pope's Exorcist takes the torch that was sparked by the revolutionary novel-turned-film The Exorcist and runs with it at full speed, while also throwing in some mystery and conspiracies for good measure. Russell Crowe takes on the role of Father Gabriella Morth, a real priest of the Vatican who was said to have performed over 10,000 exorcisms. In this fantastical reimagining of Father Amortha's tales of battling demons, Crow dives deep into Roman Catholic history and gives a fantastic performance as a priest who not only has to fight against the forces of hell, but also his own institution in order to save a young child from his possession. So the Pope's exorcist. Number 4. Run Rabbit Run Run Rabbit Run is a terrifying psychological thriller directed by Dana Reed. Nestled in the breathtakingly gorgeous landscape of Australia, which only enhances the unsettling foundation of the film's premise, Run Rabbit Run features an undeniably incredible performance from Succession star Sarah Snook as a successful fertility doctor whose daughter seems to be possessed by the spirit of her deceased sister, Alice. Run Rabbit Run is a gripping watch not only because it centers on a haunting mystery but also due to the breakout role for young Latori, who fearlessly enchants on screen against Snook. <laughs> Number 5. Things Heard and Seen Based on the novel All Things Cease to Appear by Elizabeth Brundage, Things Heard and Seen is a chilling story about a young couple that moves into a country home with a disturbing past. Amanda Seyfried brings the audience on her journey as she explores the darkness in her new house, town, and marriage. Contrasted with Seyfried's naive yet restless Catherine is her suspicious husband George, played sinisterly by James Norton. Co-directed by Sherry Springer Berman and Robert Pulcini, things seen and heard blends old-school psychosexual thriller tropes with updated horror technologies to produce a terrifying modern classic. Number 6. Bird Box Barcelona Bird Box Barcelona, the spin-off sequel to the 2018 film based on the Josh Mailerman novel, is a thrilling post-apocalyptic horror film that goes beyond a creature feature to explore the monstrous aspects of man. The story takes place in a ravaged Barcelona and follows Sebastian and his daughter, as they team up with other survivors of the entities that must not be perceived to escape the pursuit of a dangerous cult that forces people to look upon the creatures, leading them to commit suicide. This expansion to the Bird Box lore is a fascinating dive into the ways that humans deal with great loss, as well as the ways that religion can become destructive. Number 7. Lights Out Lights Out, 
the directorial debut of David F. Sandberg, is about a woman coming face to face with the supernatural forces that haunt her family. Co-starring Maria Bello as the woman's mother, along with an unexpected performance from young actor Gabriel Bateman, Lights Out is a skillfully crafted horror flick that weaves a captivating story with rich performances and chilling scares. Co-written by Eric Heiserer and Sandberg, Lights Out builds an unsettling experience with hair-raising thrills and a creepy maleficent force without relying on gore. Number 8. We Have a Ghost When the Presley family moves into a low-priced fixer-upper, they soon realize they have a ghost named Ernest living in the attic when a teenage son Kevin catches him on video. Seeing it as an opportunity for money and fame, Kevin's dad Frank uploads the video and creates an instant viral sensation that draws national attention to their house, but some of the eyes watching them could put their family in grave danger. We Have a Ghost is a new spin on the haunted house trope that uses internet virality in the ghost hunter craze to create a hilarious original film. <laughs> Number 9. Viking Wolf Directed by Stig Svensson, who co-wrote the screenplay with Espen Aachen, Viking Wolf is a Norwegian horror film that applies an unexpected and fun variation to traditional werewolf narratives. Surrounded by a scary mystery and placed in an unsettling atmosphere, Viking Wolf stars Ellie Rhiannon Muller Osborne as Thale, a teenage outcast who moves to a small town where her mother begins working for the local police department. Featuring impressive CGI for the beasts and impactful use of blood, gore, and shadows, the thrilling story of Viking Wolf succeeds with spine-tingling excitement. Number 10. The Silence John R. Leonetti's The Silence is based on Tim Lebin's novel, blossoming from a similar premise to A Quiet Place. Set in a world attacked by creatures who use sound to hunt their prey, The Silence follows a deaf teenager, played by Kiernan Shipka, and her family as they attempt to find shelter. Unbeknownst to them, they fall in with a cult. Shipka is undoubtedly a talented actress, but the silence was greatly criticized for the casting of a hearing actress in a deaf role, as well as Shipka's non-Native American sign language skills. Even with its faults, the silence is a heart-pumping adventure that also stars Stanley Tucci, John Corbett, and Shipka's chilling adventures of Sabrina co-star Miranda Otto. If you like a video give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. For more content like this don't forget to subscribe to the channel.